Good morning, my dear friends. Our topic for this morning is strengthen your wall. Strengthen your wall. Is there any time you were worried about your blood test result? Is there any time you were devastated when your doctor sent you back for the further medical test? Or are you really concerned or scared about your long-standing sickness? King Hezekiah was in the same situation as you. When prophet Isaiah told him about the seriousness of his deadly disease, he was really devastated, broken in spirit. Let's read that from 2 Kings chapter 20, verse 1. In those days, King Hezekiah was sick and near death. And Isaiah the prophet the son of Amos, bent to him and said to him, Thus says the Lord, Set your house in order, for you shall die and not live. Saints, King Hezekiah was very depressed and displeased about the news. However, he did an amazing thing which brought him healing and restoration by our heavenly God. Let's read that too. 2 Kings chapter 20, verse 2. Then he turned to his face toward the wall and prayed to the Lord. What is the wall here? What is the significance of the wall here? My friends, the wall is nothing but the goodness of God in his past life. The wall represents God's care, which was extended in his past situation. It was God's mighty hand, which preserved him in his olden days. Bible says, he did not look for the visitor's face. He did not even look at the medical report. Rather, he turned his face toward the wall. He focused on the mercy of the Lord. Today, are you passing through the helpless condition? Are you feeling you are very weak in your life? Are you really concerned about your body condition? Or are you disturbed by the medical report which you have in your hand at the moment? Here is the prophecy just for you from Isaiah 49 verse 16. See, I have inscribed you on the palms of my hands. Your walls are continually before me. God always remembers your wall. Turn towards the wall and focus on God's care and kindness. Lift your problems in your prayer to the Lord because there is always hope in Jesus who is your great physician. He who revived King Hezekiah today will also revive you, heal you, and extend your lifespan. Let's pray. Father in heaven, we thank you, dear Lord. You always remember our wall. Lord, our wall is nothing but what you have done in our lives in the past. Lord, when we remember what you have done in our past, we have no worries and fear for our future. Please, dear Lord, strengthen our wall so that we will not focus our medical report. We will not listen to our visitors' words. Rather, we will lift our hearts and problems to you. Where does the help come from? Thank you for the hope, O Lord. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen and amen. God bless you. Have a blessed day.